Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I know, I know, I've been at my A. I feel like I haven't sat here and talked to you guys in so long. It's because I haven't, I haven't filmed in so long. I think I didn't, I didn't film for the whole month of August. I know I posted a video last week, but that video was filmed like in the beginning of August and I just didn't have a chance to film or edit or do anything to my channel for the whole month with Mia starting school and then back to the old karate schedule and then she changed karate schedules because she now she's in a different rank and with my job work was crazy because the elections was going on in August it it was just hectic so um with that being said so I didn't film my August uh, for a play yes I didn't film my August Sephora for a play because of all the chaos um and anyways that month wasn't all that so hopefully this month will be a little better so let me stop rambling about life and let's just continue on with this video and the first thing I see I see really good stuff in this month's box like I'm really really excited I see some Kat Von D I see some Anastasia some living proof Sephora you did good this month so the first thing I'm pulling out is this Anastasia brow gel and it's the clear brow gel. I already have this so I'm going to have a second because I use my own one when I do like my friend's makeup and stuff like that so I'm glad they sent this one. It's a smaller version um, than the, obviously than the regular one but it's great so I can take it on the go or when I'm doing someone else's makeup I can use it but this thing is awesome like you I even use this on days that I'm not doing makeup I'm doing my brows but I want to like tame them down this thing is amazing and it really helps for if you use it often to really untame if your brows are unruly um I ended up buying it I want to say like last year because my eyebrow lady had told me to buy it because I had unruly unruly brows they were just all over the place. So she's like, if you buy, if you use this and you use it constantly every day, eventually your brows will start getting tamed. And she was so right. And I'm so thankful for her. Um, but this thing is amazing. I think regular price, it's like $22. But it will last you a long, long, long time. I know on Anastasia products, people are like, oh my god, it's so steep. But her products are very good in quality and they will last you a very long time a super long time so it's a great great investment so if you guys got this in this month's box try it out you will not be disappointed if you don't have it you need to go buy this this is a staple that you need in your collection because it, it, it's a must even if you have even if you are those girls who are blessed with full eyebrows all the power to you but this, just to tame them down, just to ha set your brows, amazing. So the next thing in this month's box is the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Nightcap Overnight Perfector. Mouthful. But it seems to be like an overnight leave-in mask for your hair. And then the next day you can just shampoo it, wash it out of your hair. But it will last you all week. So, like I showed you guys before, Sephora is brings includes in their box this little pamphlet and it shows everything that's included in the box and the instructions and what it's used for and all those uh, that goodie and it says um how to apply it says before bed work into damp or dry hair distribute from root to tip focus on ends leave on overnight and then shampoo your hair the next day or you can just not shampoo it in the next morning and shampoo it on at night and it, it says the results will be the same either way um and it's it also states that it will last a whole week so i'm kind of intrigued i'm kind of um i want to see how this works so i'm kind of intrigued i know this brand is very good i think my boss and i think i've seen my best friend use this brand and i've heard very good things about, about it on here on youtube on blogs and in sephora so I'm kind of excited. I mean, anything to make my hair better, I'm always on board. Even though not to toot my own horn, even though not to toot my own horn, but I'm having a very good hair day. It's so bouncy. Look at that. Look at that. Next up, we have this Ole 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 Ole. This Ole Hendrickson Sheer Transformation 
facial cream, it's a facial moisturizer, and it says it can also double up as a makeup primer. So that's a plus. And it says it's to help soften, brighten, and even your skin tone. As you guys already know, those are three things I'm on board for. Even tone, brighten skin, yes sir. And this brand is amazing. I think I tried one of their like scrubs ones as a sample. And it was so good, but it was so expensive that I was like, I want to, but how my bank account looks, I really don't want to spend money on you. <laughs> so yes, I'm super excited to try this, especially that it doubles up as a primer. Um, I know sometimes, even though like I use a lot of moisturizer, I just, I'm, I like to keep my routine simple. And I just sometimes hate that I have to put on a serum put on a moisturizer and then put on my makeup primer and I like, girl that's too much for me so I'll let you guys know how this works we'll see next up they included this mini Sephora lipstick and it says Sephora Rouge Brilliant Rouge Shine lipstick in Love Spell it's so tiny and cute but I'm sure it's pink yep it's pink even though it's a nice pretty like a muted pink. I think I can do this. I'll rock this. I know, I think my first box, the first one that I filmed here, I they included one from Bite Beauty that was like a hot pink lipstick. And I gave it to my sister-in-law because on me, it does not look good. On her, yes girl, you can rock it all day, but on me, no. <coughs> so let's test it out. Oh, it's very, very sheer. Very sheer. And it doesn't look, see, this looks like a muted pink, but when I swatch it, it looks like a baby, I don't know. It's coming off like this on camera, but if here, it just looks like a, like a baby Barbie pink, kind of, not, I'll see how it looks, but since it's so sheer, I'll probably just give it to Mia so she can play with it. So the next thing in this month's box I'm really excited for and it's the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner and it's her liquid liner. It's a liquid liner but obviously in pen form and I mean it's Kat Von D. She's like the queen of a wing liner so I'm sure this will be awesome and I have never tried anything from her brand so I'm really excited to try this. I think I had a friend tell me she tried it I think it was my friend Ali and she told me good things about it I'm not sure did she anywho I'm excited to see let's swatch this ooh nice and precise this is very sharp as you can see and you don't even have to press it I know I have like some pen eyeliners that you really have to like, kind of sometimes press it down but this one I did not have to at all just look at that go thicker go lighter oops Ooh, I'm excited to try this I'm excited and it comes out super black I'll let you know, and it looks like it dries matte, so that's a plus, I like it. Yes, yes, yes. And as you guys already know, the last thing in this one's box, Sephora always sends a sample of a perfume, and if I can open it up, I'll show you guys. Um, this month is the... You guys know, I, I think I've said this name before on this on my channel, but I butcher it, so I'm sorry beforehand. Is that Ate, Atelier? Ate, I want to say it in Spanish, and I think that's my problem. Like, I, I'm, I'm trying to say it in English, but when I see the word, I want to say it in Spanish, and I want to say Atelier. I, I can't even say it in Spanish. <laughs> it's Atelier. 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 Oh, now I can't say it. Damn it! I said, yeah, like, it's in my head. Now I can't say it. You get it? Does that ever happen to you guys? Like, you know how to pronounce a word. It's in your head. You can see it. You can hear it in your head. But it doesn't come out, like, the way you want. And it's the Atelier. 
whatever we're gonna move forward it's a cologne and it's called sud magnolia and it's a refreshing floor blend that balances delicate notes of magnolia with layers of wood and citrus so let's give this a little whiff as you know it comes in this little cute bottle and they included this cute little postcard with it super cute let's give it a whiff Mm -mm, me not like you. No. Not a fan. It smells. It actually smells like something my boyfriend wears. Not that. <laughs> that sounded so bad. Not that he smells bad or his cologne smells bad. It's just like not something I would get for myself because it it smells like him. It smells like a guy cologne. If you, if you know what I mean, yeah, you know. Not, it doesn't smell bad. Let me rephrase that. It doesn't smell bad. It smells good, but not for a woman's perfume. It's, it's very manly. I guess since it has wood, it smells very masculine to me. It smells, it reminds me of something my boyfriend wears. That's why I don't like it. I like it on him. That's before, babe. Before you see this video, you're like, this bitch. Don't like Halloween ass <laughs> No. Let's rephrase it. It smells good. It's just, personally for me, and I think personally for women, I think it's a little too masculine. Um, but, if this is the man's perfume, more power to you. So, maybe I'll just slip it in and put it in his dresser and he won't even notice. <laughs> Okay guys, so that's it for this month's box. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, let me know if you guys like how my makeup came out today. I really went off the box. I mean, me to use blue liner, that's a first. So if you guys like how my makeup look, let me know. If I get some positive feedback, I'll end up um, filming a video about it. So let me know. It was super easy. It took me like 30 minutes not even like 20 minutes to do my makeup so let me know if you guys enjoy it and i will do a video on this makeup look with that being said thank you so much for watching and please subscribe bye guys